What's up guys? So I am driving right now. Um, I need to roll my windows up and turn my air on because you guys will not be able to hear me once I start going. My window is hot. Um, here we go. And I always gotta make sure to like pull around because I always end up in like that lane over there. Not good. Not good for driving, that is it? What am I talking about anymore? But, going to get my grandma another shake, um, because she wants one. So, yeah, gonna go get that for her. Um, or my grand mom, mom, as my mom called her. I don't know. It's just, we're all, like, losing our minds. So, yeah, gonna go get that shake for her, because I would do anything for my grandma. Um, but yeah, we were just kind of, like, all sitting with her a little bit ago, talking about stuff, and that was cool. Um, I was looking through pictures today, too, uh, what my mom was, um, you know, just for, like, um, I guess for when the funeral or whatever. I don't know. Um, but we were looking through pictures, and I found a lot of me. It was really weird. I I have not always, or I've not ever been normal, I don't think. I've always been kind of, like, kooky and crazy and weird and... I wouldn't change it any other way. Like, there's a lot of pictures of me when I was a baby. Um, and I'll have to, like, get them out and show them to you because it's really funny. Um, but there's a lot of pictures of me from when I was, like, little. And I literally, I'm pretty sure I could have been a meme. Like, that's how weird I was. Like, I was just always, like, like this and on my pictures. Like, looking like I was going to crazy, go crazy on someone. But, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go get this uh, shake and I'll talk to you guys in a little while. Okay, so I also went through McDonald's, and I legit did not get any of my food. <laughs> like, any of it. I got, like, two things that I ordered. This is, like, this is the third time, okay, I'll tell you the truth. This is the third time I've gone to McDonald's. Now, not today, but in the last, like, three, like, the last month. I haven't got any of my food. <laughs> like, all of my food, at least. Thank you for just McDonald's. What can I get for you? Yeah, I was just through here, and I didn't get, like, half my food. <laughs> Alright, just pull to the second window. Please. Okay. So they didn't even ask me what I didn't get, so they're just going to give me the entire order new. So, like, definitely working on a flight to McDonald's now tonight. Um, like, this is ridiculous, bro. Like, how do you... How do you... Like, how do you forget Big Macs? Their signature item. How do you forget chicken nuggets? Another signature item. How do you only put fries and glazed chicken strips in here? Man. Man, oh man. I should have just went in. <laughs> this went faster. Man, this girl in this van right here, this is the second time that she's gone in. Oh, shit. He was like, why the hell is he recording? But that girl in this blue van right here, this is the second time she's gone in. Get your shit together, McDonald's. Dude, they are running a shit show. Oh my God. This, this is my, I asked God for a sign and uh, you know, this obviously, this is my sign to get freaking healthy. <laughs> like, okay, let me see. I've been in the drive-thru for 13 minutes. How does this happen? How? And, they're like, well, and then these guys had to pull up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Then they forgot to give me extra ice in my drinks and... This is a shit show, man. This is a shit show for sure. S3. S... SS... FS. SSFS. Shit show for sure. So let's see, okay, it's 5.03. Let's see how long it takes. So it's been, actually it's been 5.02. So let's see how long it takes, because I've been recording for a minute. So let's see how long it takes. The amount of people going back in right now, oh my god. Holy crap. Like, I'm, okay, so I'm, I'm next door to McDonald's right now. Um, and they keep having to bring everybody's food, like, re bring everybody's food back out. That girl just went back in to get a drink, which is kind of smart, actually. 
they're just like I don't know what's going on like there was people yelling at people so I don't know if maybe just something going on in the actual like management situation I, I don't know I, 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 I don't know just weird gonna get my grandma shake country school sponsor me okay guys so I want to kind of talk to you guys about something really quickly that I I received today um, I received some CBD oil and now I know that's kind of maybe a little bit controversial but um, I have really bad back pain and eczema and it legit helped with both um, I put it on yesterday uh, before like around noon one noon or one o'clock 11 30 one o'clock something in that time range and I didn't have bad pain all night all day all night and I woke up pain free now, like I said, this is a little, you know, some people, you know, don't believe in, like, marijuana use, but I am a full believer in it now, um, you know, uh, I believe there's a documentary from Dr. Sanjay Gupta, and there's, like, maybe four parts to it now, but he goes into, um, everything about, um, you know, marijuana and how it can be used as a medicinal treatment. I'll link all that below, um, so you guys can watch that. But it, it really, it helps, and I'm a believer. Like, let me, let me show you guys something. Uh, let me show you guys, which one do I want to show you? This one. So as you can kind of see, like, right, it looks redder on camera, but this was like a deep, deep red on my hand. Let me go over here. So this was like a deep, deep red on my hand. It, it, now it's really showing up a lot better. And now it's not as red. Um, up here, it was all red. It looked like a rash up here. Um, it was all scaly, and now it's all soft, and the redness has gone down, so I'm gonna put some on my finger tonight before bed, um, but yeah, guys, I'm a believer in it, uh, I'm gonna get some more, I think, sometime from Kevin, a cream, which I think will help me a little bit better, um, but yeah, definitely a believer in the, in the CBD oil now, um, it's just really interesting that, like, um, I've always... I've 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 been looking for a solution to my back pain and I I've never ever 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 wanted to take painkillers um and I don't to, in my opinion I don't think that the CBD oil the marijuana is a pain is is a med it's a medication but it's not an opiate or something like that um you know and I, I be, because my worst fear in life has been becoming addicted to a drug. And I'll be honest with you, I did at one point in my life become addicted to painkillers. And it was really bad time in my life. And yeah, so something I just don't want to talk about really. Um, but this, I feel like because it's not an actual medication you're taking, it's oils. Um, I'm, I'm down for that. But I've never, like, since, you know, this little... Um, the habit that I had back in the day, um, which sounds so stupid and cliche, but it, it was real. Ever since I stopped taking the painkillers, um, I don't really take them as much. The last time that I really had any, like, real painkillers was, um, after transplant. I took some just because the pain was really bad, um, but I, I took maybe three pills, um, and that was over, like, a month. So, like, one a week I was taking um, and I really wish I would have had this, like, CBD oil, maybe to help, you know, just take a little drop, take the pain away, um, and, like, when I had my bone biopsy last month, or two months ago, two months ago now, um, I didn't take any painkillers at all, I took Tylenol, that was it, um, but yeah, they prescribed me Percocets, and I just did not want to get into that, so, yeah, um, no more painkillers. I don't want to take painkillers, but this stuff helps my back so much. I'm so relieved with it. Like I, um, I, you may or may not know, I have scoliosis. Um, you'll get kind of a little bit more into that Friday, uh, not Friday, um, Sunday in the vlog. Um, I'm doing the 50 facts about me vlog, and um, you'll get a little bit more insight into that um, Sunday or Monday, I guess, when I upload it. But yeah. Um, anyway guys, I'm gonna go to bed, um, I'm gonna put a little more of this oil on, and I'm gonna head to bed, like I said, so I will talk to you guys tomorrow, I hope you had a fantastic day, peace, and rock on.